Accusations against Mobile Police Chief James Barber have sparked controversy. Word quickly spread yesterday that he unlawfully pulled out a gun on a thief, and it all began with an email to Councilman Fred Richardson. Today, Richardson defended himself, saying all he was doing was passing along the message. News 5's Alan Carter reports. Fred Richardson wants to remind people that there is a big difference in the words filed versus forwarded. It should have started. Oh, it shouldn't have ever started. It, all I did was forward a complaint to the mayor. Richardson says yes, his office received a complaint from a citizen over police chief James Barber. It said Kenneth Pageant claims Chief Barber unlawfully pulled a gun on him Monday. But says all he did with it was send it off to the mayor's office. I did what I always do. I forwarded it on to the mayor's office and I told the mayor that I was going to call the person, but it would be within the hour because I wanted to give him a heads up before the person called him. That was the end. I did nothing else. Two hours later, a statement came from Mayor Sandy Stimson saying they were investigating Chief Barber. She may be led to believe that uh, I initiated this. I, I, I didn't initiate anything. We talked to the man behind the complaint on Thursday who admits that yes, he was stealing when the confrontation happened. I was hoping he'll cut me a little break because we ain't one doing that was getting scrapped by the better man. We have been doing it for a couple of weeks and we don't hurt nobody, man. Friday, Chief Barber gave his two cents on the matter. My advice to Mr. Padgett is that the next time he is caught in the process of a burglary, that he contact a lawyer and not his counsel. And for this, opposition to Richardson has been heavy and frequent, particularly on social media. What the people um, are led to believe is false. It's based on something false that, that I filed a complaint. I forwarded a complaint. The real word should be I forwarded a complaint to the mayor because it's under his purview of authority. Well, the mayor's office today said the claim against Barber was baseless. We did reach out to ask exactly why they sent this case out so early on in the investigation to the media, but they did not return our request for comment. Reporting live in the newsroom,